and I've worked down in this area undoing it and then I went in here and I lay my ass down on this I might have a picture of how disgusting it was see this see, see what I'm dealing with here see this this is some see this this is some 1964 comb it's pretty disgusting I'm not gonna lie I was actually that appalled I didn't take the seat out I just went home why do I do it I've just recorded three videos without the mic in it's still a bit early and I don't want to start it like that but what an idiot anyway today's a new day the master cylinder is done it's done we are happy we have a clutch now how I did it how, how to how to real quick is I undone the clutch line I undone this flexi line which goes to the reservoir I took those off luckily there was no brake fluid in there or clutch fluid whatever you want to call it in there so we didn't have any leakages and then I'm going to record all this again, so I'm going to probably miss a few things. I took the seat out, my ass I sliding under the dash with the seat in there. So, take it out, give ourselves some room to lie down. But what I had to do was hoover all this because this is what I was dealing with. Just look at it, there's a comb in here. A comb! It's at least from the 1940s. I can't be can it because the car's only in 95. Shit. Anyway, on the inside, take the seat out, give you some room, lie your ass down, and there's a clutch pedal. As you can see, that gold bolt there, I think that's a 12 mil, and there's another one the other side at the top. I think you can see it. Maybe, right there. And then, you have to take the circle out. See, this is a bit difficult and tight. But as you can see, there's a little clip here in this little hole. You pull the clip out, circle clip, and then you pull the rod out. And that actually allows you to pull the whole master cylinder out. There is, when I was reinstalling it, there's a little bit of thread. Can you see? Here, there's some thread, hopefully you can see, and a nut, and I had to adjust the rod so it was resting on the pedal stop here. So now we have full pedal and engagement. Ah, that was me. So now I have full pedal, it's bled. I had a friend help me bleed it. His name is Grant. A great success! We bled the clutch and now we have a clutch. I just hope it doesn't slip because that will be the next thing, brother. Let's be honest. This car's full of surprises. But today, put all that aside, we're going to try welding again. This side is ready. The welds, the areas I'm welding for the spot welds, is clear. And the skin. Is ready to pull back. This side has got its first skimmer filler. I'm not in a rush to do that. And the other rear quarter <laughs> is ready and waiting for action. Nice, eh? Hey, that. Anyway, 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 anyway. Oh, so, 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 so. I'm gonna set the welder up, and I'm gonna get myself comfy. I'm gonna start welding. We'll get it somewhere near. I've already disconnected the battery. I don't know why we do it, but I've just been told to disconnect the battery when you're welding. So if you need that advice, take it. I'm gonna throw you on charge 
for a little bit. Ooh, sleep is there. Good timing. So, I've ended up cutting this a little bit further back because I found some rust around that hole. And there's no point putting corners now, is there? So, I've cut the shapes. I'm just getting them all in line. And I'm going to throw some tacks on them now. I'm starting to make moves, boys. are starting to make moves. Good afternoon. How are you today? Happy man. Boy. So, only one burn so far. Straight in between my fingers, like last time. But, the main shape's there. It's all tacked in. Oh, oh nice, 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 tack, tack, tack. I'm just going to put insert a little bit here. And then, that'll be it. Nice bit of welding, nice bit of welding. Oh, welcome to my hood. So, ran out of gas. Ran out of gas. Started acting a little bit. Started acting a little bit weird. And then the, the weld wasn't cooling down. So, I presume the gas has gone. And then I was like, tch, 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 and nothing. So the gas is gone. I'm not going to be able to do any more welding today. It's okay. The fender, he's on. At least tax on. What do we think? Not too bad, not too bad. Not too bad. I don't know what to do the rest of the day, man. I might do some body work on this side. I think I might do that. I don't know. We'll see, we'll see. Oh, dusty, dusty, dust. So, my first pass of filler. As you can see. I don't really want too much on. It's not bad up there, it's a bit low here. It's a bit low here. It's a bit low there. Overall, not too bad for the first skin. I know it's not body shop quality. Well, it's cutlery's quality. We've got tea now. We're having some lunch. Having some lunch. Just waiting for the lunch. Reloading. Waiting on gas. I've told you this 20 times. I've just decided to do another quick skim. I had a few low spots. So I thought I'm going to take the time now to get the welding done. I need to order some seam sealer because what I want to do is create a bead on the inside of where I've welded to just help protect it and just keep it from the elements if any water gets in there or any damp. You never know. Sleepy provided some lovely food. Thank you very much Mokka. Lovely, lovely. <laughs> I didn't buy, I mean, I didn't cook. <laughs> you just bought some food. Bought, bring, whatever. I've only got one burn today, which is not bad. Didn't set myself on fire. Probably because I ran out of gas. But, you know, we, uh, it's been a great day. I'm happy now we're making movement on the car. Before anybody moans, I am not creating a burp machine <laughs> a, a mint i'm not creating a mint car oh, i want to make sure what the thinners yeah so i'm not getting rid i'm not repairing dents because there's dents all down here there's dents everywhere i'm not creating a show car i just want a rust free clean ish car because I want to use it, I want to have fun in it, and I don't want to be worried about, oh, my paint, and oh, this, uh. so I'm just going to get done, what I need to get done, 
get it out and enjoy it while we can. Oh, I'm sorry. Yet again, completely forgot. So I'll put a second skim on the rear quarter because we had some weird low spots here. So that's now gonna go off till that's gonna go off and now till tomorrow. And um, this side is welded. Lovely jubbly. Oh sorry. Oops, oops a daisy. Uh I just followed the lines and that looks very nice too. I'm gonna go to Halfords tomorrow. That's a good thing actually. I'm gonna get the gas canister. And I'm going to get that swapped over for a new one. And we'll be able to crack on. That's going to be it for today. Thank you for coming. And I'll see you soon.